Have you ever considered what's better, gummy bears or gummy worms? I was at the store and I sat there, for, I, I can't, I promise you, 15 minutes, trying to decide which one was better. Did and you the, like before or something? No, I was just hungry. I was just, literally, I, I was literally- They're I'm, totally I, different though. They're not made of the same stuff. I agree. Facts. But I ended up getting like the cherries instead of like horror ones because I couldn't decide, so fuck it, I'm out. I just grabbed those. I don't like worms. I prefer the bears. But why? I don't know, different Portion text. size? Portion, not in there. Gotta be, that's it. You're not exactly. chewing on it too long? Portion size, and they're the originals. Yeah, but the gummy worms, I mean, they're fun start. to play with. I don't fuck with worms. No, no. You don't fuck with worms. Bro, I, you've eaten a worm. You ate worm, boogers sure. and worms. I don't want to. You know what? We got some 700s. You want to try? Let's just get this started. <laughs> Fucking shit. The Mars. <laughs> Look at these fucking box, dude. That's a big box. It's a, he, enormous. I'm dude. not sure if the camera can see that, but that's got to be double the size of a normal shoe box. You know, it 100% is, and it's got all the writing on it. They're wild. This is going to be fucking silly. This is the silliest shoe. You I ever bought know. something this with the silly shoe? Yeah, I mean, I buy stupid shit all the time. All right, so we've got the Mars Yard overshoe. <laughs> Whoa. Space boot, man. Facts or some shit. It looks like something Neil Armstrong Look at would this. wear. Definitely. these. Insane. I don't know the story behind all of it. I mean, what does this remind you of? It's an astronaut It's a boot. fucking space boot. It's a NASA space boot. I mean, look at the color. But you, I mean, so Tom Sachs is, is an artist, right? right. He's, he's mad obsessed with space, with NASA. Uh, so he designed the first ones. I can't get my hands on them now. They're like fucking three Gs, almost $4,000. So expensive. And initially I was like, I don't know if I want them. And then the more I looked at them, the more I wanted them. And the second shot at it, when, these, when they said that these were coming out, when I saw them, I'm like, I'm not getting the shoe until yeah, Until, why, why, is there, why, do, why are these here? Why Let's are talk these here? About it. Because inside the fucking shoe is the Mars. Yeah. Is that what that is? And yep. it's, it's, it's not. It's the actual shoe. So it's hard to see them. Yeah, it's hard to get in so there. So if you can get inside of there, once you take the bag off, and that's why a lot of people bought them. I mean, that's why you bought them. That's why I bought them. It's, and so I'll, I'll just kind of cut to the chase. What I did was I cut the bag off, I cut the, the blue outsole off, this toe, all that stuff and you get down to the shoe on the inside. What I came to find out quickly though is that if you don't know what you're doing, you just cost yourself a lot of money. You <laughs> is that a, what you did? You made a big mess did of it. Did you fuck up? I didn't do a great job. I had to send them off to a customizer. It's in Stockton, California. It's currently working on my pair. And when we get them back, we will be sure and feature them because yeah, they're, they're gonna, look, these on they're gonna look so good when they're done. Let's do this. There's some differences too. So, um, between the original and this one. I don't think this one has space material in it. The laces are different though. The original had a full lace. This has this crazy, like- It's got a lace up. Pull tie thing. Pull tab. I don't know what you even call this. It's like a quick cinch. It's got one on the outside too. Yeah, let me see you stand up. What up? Yeah. Is this me? You look really cool. That actually, I, mean, Is this me? I think they're, they're cool the way they are. I had to pull my pants down though, a little bit. Let me tuck them in. Let's I see. think I'm gonna get two pair. I'm gonna get one to display like this. And then I'm gonna have the other. See what I mean customer. about throwing away money? That ass, but they, I, I, I kind of like them. And retail was stupid high on these. They're 500 bucks. 550 was retail. It's a cool shoe. I mean, they're sick. I'm, I'm gonna send them off. I'm gonna send them off to your same boy because I would prefer not to wear them with this shit. Unfortunately, we are not in New York, so I'm not too worried about walking you, in. You're slush. never gonna get the chance. And we'll, we'll circle back around to these whenever mine come back in. Yeah, fact. Once again, you know I did it. The 700. I, I feel like you're doing another this on variation. Purpose. You're like trying to haunt me. I'm trying. I'm trying to get kicked off the ship. Back. Get out. <laughs> get out. See how get out. how fast I can just you know make my tenure here. Which was which was these? So this is the Vanta colorway. Oh shit! Let me see it. This is the Vanta. So Damn. we'll feature this here. I, I like these. You dig it? No. Did you all hear that? I do not <laughs> like these. These are fucking trash. What is this? What oh, is this? Man, what is this shoe? Broke my heart. This is the Vanta. You know, this is the first time I've actually seen it. I haven't opened the box yet. So this looked more gray in a lot of the pictures. And I guess it's a 3M though. That. It's 3M, because I, I can see it on yours. It's got a 3M yeah, hit on there or something. So it's kind of silvery in certain lights. It is. Um, it's a 700 V2. It's not the original. I'm not a fan of the V2 as much as I am the one. Ortholite. Is that for old people? 
Look at this fucking shoe. <laughs> is it for old people? This shoe, you know, you ever been to fucking Walmart? Hi, welcome to Walmart. <laughs> can I help How can you? I help you? Yeah. Uh, aisle three. Yeah, aisle three looking ass shoes. I'm not gonna lie. All Hi. black shoes to uh, me do Welcome to Sam's like Club. That. Can I check your ID, please? Yeah. This is, what the fuck is this thing? This is the, like, the Chili's waiter shoe, you know? Somebody explain to me, please. Someone leave me a comment on why these shoes are cool because I still don't fucking get it. You don't this get shoe it. sucks. All right, when me and my brothers used to fight when we were kids, my mom used to always say, I'm gonna make you guys sit down and tell me one nice thing about each other. <laughs> Go, James. It's your turn. Eventually, you'll never have to wear them again? That's not a nice thing. That's a backhanded. That's nice. Ah! Someday you won't have to wear the shoe again. Backhanded. Give me one nice thing. That was nice. That wasn't it, it, nice, Dappa. It has boost. Thank you. That's a nice He'll thing. He'll take it. That's all I get. The best part, I mean, okay, let's see. Uh, I like the canvassy material on top. You dig that? It's a little different. Oh, that is weird. It's that canvas. is canvas. It's, it's canvas, like yeah. Carhartt. It's like a sack. That's weird. It's like a burlap sack. Material. Potato sack, man. Yeah, sure. I, that's kind of different. At least I haven't seen that before. It's kind of feels a little lighter than the ones that I had to wear for fucking seven days. <laughs> no, Your, all, yours like, were nicer like, than this. You, I, I did you a favor. I could have had you wear yeah, this one. Yeah, these aren't it, bro. I mean, at least the you know, I, the, I like the color a little bit. Seeing them for the first time, I'm gonna have to agree. I don't think these are it. I think you're right. Dabba's got a trash can, baby. Just let me know. We can handle we it right now. They're brand new. They're yeah. Yeah, still. <laughs> Reminds me of a, of a ninja foot or something. Do you like these, Dabba? Would you wear these? I got to say, uh, I like the colorway, but I do not like the silhouette. I mean, if I was looking for like the cereal aisle, It sure. looks like a skate shoe. You know what I'm saying? No, bro. Come what on. What the fuck have I been saying? It looks like a skate Every shoe. time we talk about In all black, shoes. it does. <laughs> What's wrong with skate shoes, Mr. Fucking SB on your feet? Yeah, nothing. This is just a. Then that there, must be a great is, shoe. No, this is not a great shoe. Yeah. Deadass, I think you wasted your money more on these than I did on these pieces. Uh, so, yeah, I'm not gonna talk about wasting money on stuff. We both had. We could go all day. We literally just dumb did shit it. Look we at this. purchased. Look at this. What, yeah. is, what are we doing here? This is waste your money week on off the cut. Facts. So. <laughs>
when you compare it to the next shoe? Does it live up to the hype or is it just gonna, or will it fade out? Will one of these shoes overwhelm the other or are they both? You know what I'm saying? Got some feelings on it. You know so, what shoes? So, so what, who's, who's our contender? Who's, uh, who's up next? Who's up next? Who do we got? The Sakai Waffle. These are wild too. These are crazy, right? I, I mean, another shoe with mad details. Light. Dapa, how do you feel about the shoe? I like it. Or two it's sets super of laces cool. On it's this different, thing, man. It's fresh. I've I only ever seen them in, like in, in pictures. And, you know, we didn't get we didn't get these two, these shoes haven't released yet. Yeah, shout and out Willie for these. Shout right. out Jesse for the cactus plant. Facts. Are those double tongue? Thank yeah, you. Yeah, double tongue. You know what I'm saying? Double Our, tongue, uh, double lace, double sole, double yeah. swoosh. What's up with the uh, the ledge? It's, I don't it's know. It's just a second sole. <laughs> it's just a second sole that they or a mid sole that they put. I mean, it's just for details. It's kind of a nice touch. Got a track the double stuff. Yeah. So Sakai's a Japanese brand that again is it's kind of there's a lot of there's not a lot known about them you know what i'm saying there isn't a lot especially of the owner high uh, fashion man is what yeah. i think of sakai i didn't know that the shoe was kind of see-through look at this oh wow it is see-through all the way okay that it's, mesh is it's it's, just one layer of mesh they're I mean, really minimal you know it's minimal but it's Light, it, but it's, it's not, not. look it. at all the colors this is i mean look it's a, it's, it reminds me of a marty mcfly a little bit i don't know why it's like back to the future it's, it's, a, it's like an 80s, style 80s, shoe. 80s, I mean, it's from 80s for sure, for sure. 80s running max shoe. headroom yeah wow but you know what i get from this sakai more than anything is what? like i can't help but feel that it was virgil inspired all right so vapor max in a in and of itself i've always loved the look of it i don't okay. like wearing it it looks feminine on my foot because it's really narrow it's a really narrow shoe and it fits really tight to your foot but it's a runner that's the point yeah i don't run so it's right. got but this what's cool about the the cactus plant to me is that usually nike collabs it's like 80 20. what i mean by that is 80 percent nike 20 percent creator yeah so the creator doesn't give them much of a say this is just the opposite this is 80 percent cactus plant 20 percent nike it's just barely a nike it's, but yeah they, this they've is... never done look at the laces right this thing is like a solid quarter inch thick fat they are dude they're For huge real? And the Sakai has got this this fun little twist of like this minimalistic, old school waffle sole. I mean, both the both these shoes are designed by women. I mean, that's cool. Yeah. This one's Cindy Lou, and uh, uh, this one's by Chitose Abe. Yeah, you got Sakai. it. Sakai. What? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. This, this only came in women's sizing. Yeah. What? So I, I so I, I didn't hit. So this is the biggest shoe you've ever worn as far as sizing goes, right? Facts. Eleven. <laughs> eleven. Double 11. digit, man. Yeah, finally <laughs> made it. But which one of these shoes is real? Which one of is hype? Are they both? Are they both fake? Are they both gonna fade out? And are either of these two contenders for shoe of the year? Right now, it's pretty early and brazen for us to say that. But I I have an opinion on it. What do you think? I think this is a first half all-star for contender as far you as think shoe so? of the year. You I think, think that we'll be looking back on this one and saying that's dope. Uh -huh. Still dope. This will fade. You think this will fade? Yes. I think both these shoes are very real. I think this one will slowly go away, and I think it's going to be different. I think this shoe will be the best shoe of 2019. But you know what we've seen, though? So this is one of the original. This is one of the OG colorways. Right. This comes in green right now as well, but there's yep. a gray colorway it's supposed to be hitting. That That's looks the thing. really clean. And I think the multiple colors is going to cause gonna it to fade it. out. It's going to hurt this, the... This will stand alone. It will. They're not going to do more than one of these. I think at the end of the day, both of these shoes are real. I think so. But this is going to be the shoe of the year. This will be the top shoe of 2019. Based this, on, just based on all, the whole package. This one's real as hell. This is real good. I think that this shoe will find, it will find its own little market. It'll be niche. Yeah. I think you can, some of the high fashion guys, right. some more of like the runner style right. guys. This is. Like our boy Ryan will be all over Ryan these. Ryan Swanger will be all over these. I want these. I want to have these, but I already paid. I paid this shoe. Yeah. And I don't regret it in the slightest. Double digit 11 club. I don't even care. I wear a 13 and a half, which means I'm playing you ain't probably about them. a band, maybe more You ain't getting these. them now, not, not for under a thousand bucks. This yeah. shoe right here. So I'm not this getting is, this. This is, this is the one. This is the one. Yeah, these are crazy cool, man. I, yeah. I'm going to have to say this one's just going to fade. Real, but will fade. Real, real, real. and will stand the time. Real as it gets. Yep. Yeah, these are awesome. Thanks for watching another episode of Off The Cut. Please make sure to like, click subscribe, leave some comments, let us know what you like, what you didn't like. And uh, shout out to our boys, Jesse and uh, Willie at Fresh Kicks on IG. Make sure to follow us on IG at OTC.show and we'll see you next time.